Tonight, we're seeing what happens when a burglar comes face to face with a homeowner and his gun. And tonight, the would be thief is facing charges. The homeowner is sharing his story with CBS 42's Corey McGinnis live in studio and Corey, a harrowing moment. Very much so. The alleged suspect in this case was pretty bold as the attempt burglary was all caught on tape given to us from the homeowners. Take a look. The video shows a man in a red shirt and blue jeans approaching the home. He enters through the front gate and moments later, he actually opens the patio door, but the homeowners were aware they were inside watching the entire incident unfold. Not sure what the man wanted and one of the homeowners noticed the front door wasn't locked and a few seconds later, the alleged suspect made his move entering in and that's when Shelby Tucker, the homeowner, came out with his pistol first. We caught up with Tucker and here's what he had to say. He opens it before I get there, so I just pointed my pistol right at him and said, you got the wrong house and he just he just threw his hands up. I saw a cell phone, threw his hands up and just took off. And this is a photo of the man responsible for the alleged attempt burglary. Captain David A.G. with Jefferson County Sheriff's Office says officers approached the man at gunpoint and the man obeyed the officer's commands and surrendered. A.G. says the alleged suspect will face criminal charges and get this. Tucker tells me the suspect was asking for a cell phone charger and that's why he decided to come to the house. Coming up tonight at 10, you'll hear more from the homeowner who tells me although he was prepared to shoot, he didn't want to. Live in the studio tonight, Corey McGinnis, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on. We'll see you at 10. Corey, 